what's going on y'all welcome back to the garage and welcome to my answer to die caster dies heavy metal challenge <laughs> yeah, heavy metal gold silver bronze copper yeah yeah I said why not we've got those things around here and I thought I would throw this one out there first for Michael over at diecast Looney uh, he likes his crumbled up cars and I do too uh, they're even coming out there's one five pack out now that has like two crumbled cars one that has a van that comes with like a, a monster truck now and a two pack uh, these things are freaking awesome they really are and they are full metal I mean that is full metal yeah plastic bottom but full metal I mean this thing it's a car it's a freaking car <laughs> so I thought why not let's go ahead and just start this out with the gold cars and we'll go with this can we zoom in some more can we I don't know if the tablet's gonna act right I don't know it's been giving me fits uh, so first gold car on there is this monster truck squishy squishy uh, how about this one Ba bam gold bling Batmobile cheese and crackers this thing is shiny I got to get my sunglasses Wow this thing is freaking <laughs> I didn't know I even had it y'all I found it in a box just a box with other cars in it and I was like where the heck did this come from uh, it doesn't seem like it'd be something I would buy but I did <laughs> uh, next gold one oh this is a cool one uh, this is a Myers exclusive from 2022 oh uh, yeah the uh, bone speeder pretty awesome uh, first time I ever seen a Myers exclusive in Texas was at my local HEB they didn't know what to do with them so I did pick up a couple of these and send them out to to different you know other other friends so yeah I got this one loose I think that's my last one too pretty stinking awesome though and it is gold uh, my favorite gold car of all time the grease monkey Corvette man cheese and crackers I prayed so hard to find this car I am I am not lying this was the one thing I wanted to find and I found it and I found it and I found it and I sent a lot of people that couldn't find it cars but that is a Spectre Flame gold on there red line tires just an amazing car I think probably it's the best super treasure hunt there ever was even though it's not a super treasure hunt just a premium <laughs> but I love it I love it nonetheless ah here's a couple of oldies but goodies uh, uh, this is called the uh, buzz off yeah this one sees some age I want to say this one used to be red lines and all the lines got wore off or it was just a black wall I don't remember but there it is the back end does open so you can see whoa man that thing was shiny at one time Wow yep it's a survivor y'all it's a survivor and then we've got a 57 t-bird right here in this weird I don't know it's it's just weird I don't know what these are called uh, but it's a 57 T bird and it's awesome and it's got this really cool yeah that wow <laughs> I like it I'm not gonna lie I like it that's why it's in my collection that's why it's in the collection because it's there and it's it's just freaking awesome uh, tell you what uh that I don't know where these two fall in. We'll do those we'll do those last. How about that? How about we start with some silvers? How about that? How about this shiny thing? I wanna say it looks like a rover. I don't know. This was sent to me from a friend. This thing is freaking shiny, man. I can see I can see my house in here. <laughs> love it, love it, love it. Then Oh, we gotta throw this out there in silver. The Acura uh, NSX, one of my favorite cars. <sighs> Between this and an Audi R8 Spider, the Acura NSX is probably one of my favorite cars. Modern cars, uh, just the sound of the engines, just the sleekness, just amazing. It's got two seats, so I can either dish the wife and kid at home and take the dog, <laughs> dish the wife at home and take the kid. Or just fly solo with a cooler and some adult beverage. <laughs> I crack myself up. I, I got dreams, y'all. I got dreams. Uh, this is a 2005. Yep, 2005 Ford GT. 
this came out of a five pack, and this is the only Zaymac uh, that I know exists from Matchbox. Uh, it's in a five pack. In fact, I bought that five pack twice. Uh, freaking nice car, man. Absolutely nice car. So, yeah. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. And then here's one that I got in a trade with Santa Slow Dog. Yep. This one's pretty stinking awesome. It's a Jaguar. So you can see it on there. Uh, Jaguar D type. It's in there. It's in there, trust me. I thought it was pretty cool. I'd never seen it. It's in immaculate condition, so happy to have gotten that one. Nice. And then a Ferrari 355. And I'm going to tell you right now, y'all probably say, we never seen you show a Ferrari. No, you're right. I did show a Ferrari F250 the other day. And I do have some Ferraris, but most of them are on card. And I do not feel like taking them off a of card right now. I may need to retire soon. <laughs> unless Matchbox, unless Hot Wheels gets their licensing back and then I'll be screwed. <laughs> Just kidding. I ain't got that many. But I do got some. It is a nice Ferrari, though. It's good to see Ferraris, man. Absolutely good to see Ferraris. We're close to the end, y'all. We're close to the end. So, we do have the Mad Mouse Gasser in this beautiful copper bronze color. It is copper, trust me. It is very coppery. Uh, I'm just happy to have one in pristine shape because I've stripped a couple and they turned out all right. And then, speaking of vets, let's go ahead and throw this out there. Uh, Corvette C8. In this color, I know very well because it is Zeus Bronze. I just thought that name was impressive and I thought the car was impressive in this color. It is absolutely fantastic. Uh, the back end does open. Maybe if I can do it, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to let it sit there and spin around. So uh, we are down to the last two cars and I don't know really what you can oh three cars three cars my bad <laughs> my bad all three of them are happen to be customs so here's one <clears throat> it's a mclaren f1 gran turismo racing gtr uh come on focus focus back out how about we just back out just a little bit uh definitely bronze definitely copper definitely gold i <laughs> just got a little bit of everything going for it one of my very first customs just trying to just trying to find something that I really like to do and this car just lends itself so great to be in a custom absolutely I mean there's lots of stuff to detail up on the inside like the engine and everything yeah so that one gets a little bit of all the different things bronze copper and gold uh, these two I don't know where to put them uh, these are flea market cars that I kind of did a resto mod on come on lights aren't helping I don't know if you want to call them a copper kind of orange metallic but they are definitely uh, they're not looking right on this camera my lighting is off uh, so I did that one but well, you can look at it anyway I don't care <laughs> and then this sweet white body Porsche 911 yep uh, again it goes from like a I don't know like a yellow to a gold to a dark bronze copper at the end kind of a one of the nicest fades I've ever done in all honesty uh, I really like this car and it sits up on my desk on that back screen when you're not looking at this back here you're seeing all the customs that I've done and uh, this is one of them yeah super happy with it y'all anyway that's all I got no 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 we got one more one more why not uh, go ahead and throw this out there <laughs> the Razor Crest in silver <laughs> I'm a big Mandalorian fan man I don't know what to tell you I was a Boba Fett fan since the 70s and I'm a Mandalorian fan now in the 2000s and 20s can you believe that cheese and crackers I've seen a lot of Star Wars in my life but the Razor Crest was my favorite until they blew it up at the end of season one <laughs> anyway y'all that's all I got that's my answer to uh, die cast or die heavy metal challenge and uh I hope you like it. Go check out his channel. Like, don't like, whatever you want to do. He's his own guy. But uh, I kind of like the dude. He seems all right. That being said, y'all, as always, be safe, be well, and be kind. Always be kind. Till the next time at the garage.
I'll see you later, Grease Monkeys.